guys welcome to my channel well this angle is better let me get my chair hi guys welcome to a new vlog excuse how i look but then i just knew that i had to film the intro of this vlog if not i'm not going to film it again because i've been so 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 busy my lips are dry let me wear some lip gloss kill that booty guys we're almost sold out on our lip glosses once again so this is a very very exciting vlog for me i'm so excited like i'm so 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 happy to film this vlog and share this with you guys you guys are not probably going to see this till maybe when i've already like moved in and settled because i have like a lot of vlogs not a lot i think i have like three to four vlogs before this one needs to go up and like some sit down videos too so guys i'm moving <laughs> i am moving officially like you know all the other times my move used to be like just for a month and just like trial move like the one i did to abuja the one i did in lagos also like you know i was in lagos for about two months last year into this year all those were just like trials to see where i actually want to move to but um i'm moving now <laughs> i'm so excited i'm so grateful to god for this 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 has been a long time coming honestly like this is a move that i have been moving and moving and moving this is literally me getting out of my comfort zone carrying myself out of my comfort zone a lot of my influencer friends know that i've ask them about this i've spoken to them about this this has been something that has been so scary for me this is literally me going out of my comfort zone and i'm doing this scared i'm doing this afraid same thing i know that god will see me through this process i just felt like it's time honestly like the things i want to pursue i can't really pursue them from where i am you guys if you don't know i live in kaduna it's not like lagos is the only place that opportunities but like what i am chasing lagos is like the place for me only makes sense for me to be in lagos right just came back from lagos day before yesterday i was in lagos for about two weeks i went for something business related but then like my client was never around so i decided to just go apartment hunting guys you know that i had like a lot of opportunities in lagos but i just keep running away from it and yeah <laughs> you know you know like when i went for my trial move like my business literally took off even more in lagos so when i was i decided to like leave my business and come back alone still this is me running away from lagos like i just don't want to be the one there like i don't want to leave there because i don't know like it was just a bit scary for me but we thank god i've made up my mind and i went apartment it's not the price So yeah, when I went to Lagos, um, I was just like, you know what, let me try going apartment hunting. I didn't vlog that, sadly. I'm so sorry, guys. Like, honestly, I didn't think, because I've gone apartment hunting a couple of times in Lagos, but then I end up changing my mind, because I'm just so scared. Like, this is such a big step for me, for me. You guys don't know, like, moving out on my own in Nigeria. I've moved out on my own, but that was in school. That's kind of different, but... But this one is different like this is like me going to somewhere that is this place is somewhere that is like far from home within nigeria of course you guess and i'm going to be living on my own by myself i'm not living with any family member or anything so like this is like a big step for me so i kept on shying away from it i kept on pushing it away but like i'm just grateful to god that he gave me the grace and the courage to do this i'm still i'm at home now so i came back the first day i came to pack i'm currently packing i know like honestly everything that i want is outside my comfort zone i feel like i'm so comfortable at home i don't feel like i know i am so comfortable at home like everything i want is in this house like, like i'm just so comfortable and i don't want to be comfortable i want to like push myself out of my comfort zone do more basically push myself sha like um i know i'm i'm a hard worker i know that one i'm working very hard right now but then i feel like i can't do more and every time i go to lagos like there's just this vibe i get it just motivates me inspires me i don't know the word but yeah so i went apartment hunting i got an apartment my apartment is really nice it's a very very nice place first of all i got this agent on instagram and all he showed me was rubbish <laughs> rubbish 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 <laughs> small tiny places that were just rubbish after that one i now got another um, agent and the first place he took me to literally the first place he took me to i took it it was beautiful it was nice it was really nice 
um, and I liked it, so I took it. So the next day, I made my, we did all the documents and all of that, and then I made payments, and and then the next day I came back home to come and start packing. I'm going to be at home for about a week. I want to take my time while doing this packing, and of course I want to like get some things done. I want to do my hair, I want to do my nails, I have to see my dentist guys so i did an ad with this um you guys know papaya yeah papaya x i don't know if you don't know how just check on instagram for papaya underscore x and like okay i've never really used influencers because i only use one influencer the remaining ones did not answer me so like only use one influencer and that girl like I just regret paying her, my, paying her money. So ever since then, I just talked to my Instagram ads. But then for Papaya X, I've been seeing like a lot of good reviews from her, from her ads. And then I was like, okay, let me try and do her ads. So I paid for her ads, and I think I paid on Sunday. Yeah, there was a long line, which they explained to me. And then they posted my ad yesterday, which was on Wednesday. And guys. I think I've gained almost 200 followers in less than 12 hours over 200 followers even I've gained like so many followers mm. I've made sales like uh, people are people like they are stands is she has like a good so if you're considering using any influencer I'll say consider using Papa X I don't know if her prices have changed she's having a promo right now so like it costs me um 25,000 naira for story ads so i paid 25,000 naira for story ads and like i feel like i've gotten my money's worth i've made sales more than that right now so yeah so i'm going to be vlogging this whole journey of me moving settling in getting adjusting to lagos basically i won't say i'm very very new to lagos because like i've been visiting this year alone i've gone to lagos like four times and yeah i've been visiting but i haven't lived there lived there like that and this time around i'm not leaving my family or anything i'm living on my own it's going to be a journey i'm very excited for this but at the same time i'm very very scared i'm not even going to come here and form big girl like the last and i just needed i needed this i needed something to push me and get me out of my comfort zone because like i've been so relaxed i've been way too relaxed for my liking like what happened to adventurous here? What happened to... By the way, how have I not said this? Apartments in Lagos are ridiculously priced, especially on the island. Ridiculously priced, expensive, especially if you want to be comfortable, like you want a place that has like light water, all of that clean water. It's ready to like spend a lot of money. I really, really wish I did like an apartment hunting video for you guys. I'm so sorry. Like, let me tell you, all the time that I was apartment hunting i just felt like i was doing it for fun because in my head i'm just like there's no way i'm taking this this is too scary for me i'm not doing this like i just keep i knew i have always, this is like almost two years which i've been contemplating on if i want to move to lagos or not so it has been crazy excuse how my neck is looking i'm having a chemical peel and um, my face is done it's my neck that is peeling right now so yeah that's what's happening to me it's not i don't even think you guys can see it because i think this camera camera is even like smoothing my skin but yeah it's i'll update you guys on it i don't want to come and give any update or anything on something that i haven't tried or whatever so that's it i'm excited scared you guys should just come with me on this journey um brands everything i'm now in lagos if you want to work with me please i'm in lagos i'm available for jobs i'm open for jobs i'm currently jobless i'm a jobless 22 year old that has currently just moved to lagos so please hit me with jobs bless me with jobs i'm ready i'm available let me just show you guys everything i've done so far this is what i've done this carton i put i have different boxes there are some that are still flat here and this carton my perfumes are here and i have my makeup bowl i just put my perfumes back to the um or the original boxes that they came in just keep them safe this carton has what my hair stuff some incense stuff just random random stuff shot <laughs> my clothes are going to be here this um ghana must go is taking like this pot that my sister gave to me is like a set of pots and then i have this storage bowl i have this meal prep bowl i have this bowl for like different things this one of my boxes 
Um, these are my hangers. I haven't finished packing all of them. I'm cool here also. So I'm basically just folding them into my boxes. I'm sorting them out. Like I'm putting basics in one box. Um, different things, yeah. So yeah, that's how far we have gone for now. Guys, you remember I bought this fridge. Like it's not even up to a month ago. I regret buying this fridge now. Because now I'm moving out. And what the hell am I supposed to do with it? <sighs> anyway, I have... I think I've gotten like this company that can help me move my stuff so I think I might move the fridge all I need to do is just like properly pad pad the fridge like very very well hi guys good morning hmm. okay I think that location was good how is everybody doing long time no vlog so mini life update what has been going on with me I have been good basically I have been okay I have been getting ready to leave home. It's been like today's Tuesday, a week, almost a week of me preparing. It's been like a week, yeah, of me preparing. And there's nobody at home with me right now. So um, my mom is not around. My mom is actually in Lagos, even. Basically, just me at home. So there's really nobody to help me pack. But then my friend is coming over today to help me pack because I'm packing my stuff. Let me show you guys. My box is already outside. So I have three um, boxes here, cartons, whatever. I have this Ghana must go. This is just the Ghana must go of junk. I won't say junk, but it's not junk. So it has like my tripod stand, my camera. What else does it have? I honestly can't remember. And then I have this chair because I wanted to pack these into boxes, but then they're going to enter like three more boxes. I was like, let me just put it here to make it small. Then I have my laundry basket, which I'm taking, um, and my chair. This chair I just got it newly. You guys remember. I literally got it the same day I got my fridge, so I'm not leaving it here. Guys, I have a cold right now, like I have a sore throat, and I just took cough syrup for it, but then it wasn't helping. I guess my voice sounds raspy or funny, <laughs> that's why. Um, and then I'm finally sending off my things to Lagos today, and then I'm going to Lagos tomorrow. I'm so, 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 so. Happy. I'm very happy, excited, grateful. Um, little beginnings. Um, these are my boxes. These are the only two boxes I'm taking for it. These are the only two boxes that have like my clothes. I've been contemplating if I want to carry my mannequin head or not. Honestly, I'm not sure about that now. My room is not so big, by the way. So like, I don't. It's not as big as this room here. I don't want to pack too many things. Um, until of course we start making more money and we get a bigger space. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> but little beginnings, little beginnings. Don't worry, don't worry. <laughs> anyway, my room is not so big, so I don't want to like pack everything I had in this room because everything I have in this room can definitely not fit into my room there. So I'm trying to like reduce what I'm packing. I don't want to pack too much yeah so that's 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 what we're on right now oh i don't know do i want to carry my mannequin heads i have about 12 or 15 <laughs> mannequin heads but i think i'm just going to carry like two or three so that like let's say two so that i can just be using it to keep like wigs that i straighten and i know i want to use that day so we're going to carry these two girls we're going to leave her sisters here i still have more space in my Ghana but this is like 3xl my um, tripod stands are here, cameras are here, um, my tripod stand for my mannequin head is here, my mannequin block head is here, everything is literally inside this box guys, inside this bag rather, so it's kind of this too, so yeah, let me stop them here. know how i forgot to give you guys the tea on my skin can you see my neck can you see my neck look at my neck look at my body look at my face one are you mad are you dumb i know my skin is popping can you guys see are you are you are you, are you still sleeping <laughs> guys so i'm about to go now i know that now that i started driving a bit more consistently and i'm moving to lagos <clears throat> i'm just thinking 
how will i do when i go oh my god you guys do you know how much i spend on transportation in lagos jesus very soon we'll buy a car amen from from my mouth to god's ears yeah yeah i want to go to the bank first before i get chicken because that's how the road is but if it doesn't look good i'll get chicken first before i go to the bank yeah let's see how I just got to the bank now, so I'll catch you guys when I'm out. Hi guys, I'm gonna see somebody holding camera. It's so awkward vlogging in this part of the world. So anyway, I just got out of the bank and I saw an old friend. That's actually cool. I haven't seen her in like words like like 10 years and I could remember her. And she was shocked that I could remember her. I'm like baby girl. I'm not making that mistake anymore. So, maybe you should come and direct me. Okay, so let me go. Bye. I'm about to go and get chicken. I don't know if I can take you guys in. I'm so happy today for some reason. I don't know. I thought that you see me vlogging. Vlog. You guys know I normally don't vlog like this, but we should continue like this. What do you think? I think so. Hey guys. So today is moving day. It's currently 6:52. My flight is for 9:50. I need to be at the airport by nine at least uh, and i have some errands to run so i need, i want to go out by seven i have some deliveries to drop my things are already downstairs and yeah i'm excited let's go let's go oh wait i'm so excited but i'm sad at the same time Everywhere is dark because I switched off all the lights. Yeah. We're going. I'm so happy, but then I'm nervous at the same time. I'm going. 